What's up, everybody? I'm in the trailer. I'm all packed up. Got a slide going. It's mild Saturday. We're going camping. I want some big eyeballs, and we're going to get them. Let's go. Trip has begun. Little pit stop. Little minners for the tip up at night, you know. That's how we do it. This goes here. Minners secured. All right, guys, we're almost here. I'm on a back trail here with the truck, so it's a bit shaky. Um, I'm gonna unpack. It's gonna get dark soon. Saturday, we got a bunch of rain, but uh, still a lot of snow left on the ground. And uh, I've made it to where I need to be. So guys, I'm gonna rush. I'm gonna rush and unpack this stuff and get going. Guys, I am packed up. Left the truck decently far. Let's get into the bush. I want to get some wild before we get set up in anything. It's gonna be dark. I gotta go check the ice before I go set up there and we're gonna get straight to fishing. Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna switch things up. Um, I just want, I had a Freedom Minnow spoon somewhere. Might be in here. Not sure. There it is. I got a Freedom Minnow Spoon. So, that's the Freedom Minnow Spoon. I'm, I got the Hammered Minnow Spoon right here in the Chartreuse Gold. I like this one. I'm gonna put it on this rod. Uh, Thule Perch is great for Lake Simcoe, but... All right. So I'm gonna fish with this for a bit. All right. Um, I'm gonna get set up for the night. It's supposed to rain tonight. I wanna get set up. I'll fish in the hut, chill out, cook dinner, and try to get, get them as the sun comes down. It's right. getting a bit I chill. literally had 20 minutes of fishing before it got dark. And I got lots of fish on the screen right now, as you can see. All these are good fish. My bait's up there. I'm zoomed up. Those fish are inactive. They won't bite a minnow. They won't react to anything. So I'm hoping that today was really tough. Not much action, that means they gotta eat. They gotta eat tomorrow. We're gonna hunker down for the night, wake up early, and see what we can do. Good morning, everybody. Quarter after 5 a.m. It is raining, I expected that. The hut's taking it pretty well. Just can't sleep the sound of the rain, so. My plan is to fish in the morning. I came here for the morning bite. Here we go. Finally hooked one up. Come on. Oh, well, that's a good fish, too. Don't go around the deer shit, please. Mm. Finally, it's not even a good fish. Well, it's still a fun fish. I mean, on the minnow spoon. Find the hole, but here you go. Back down you go. Oh. 
bigger fish. Yeah. Tex textbook, I knew that one wanted to eat. Uh -huh. And ourselves a nice walleye getting bigger. Crush that freedom middle spoon. My hands are messed up so I can't really touch them aggressively. And he choked that spoon. Look at it. He might be turning on. I got two big fish on the screen. I'm gonna let him go. He's down. It's coming up quick now. That's a better fish. That's what we're after right here. Don't go into deucer cable. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Alright, go do your thing. Don't be in the deucer cable, please don't, please don't. Don't, please don't, please don't. Oh, he's on the side of that mouth there. <laughs> Look at the size of this fish, guys. He wants to come out of the hole by himself. Low six, seven pounder this morning. <laughs> all right, all right, let's go. Well, finally. What I'm looking for, I came here for for some good walleye, and that's definitely the walleye I've been wanting to catch. Um, we're gonna take quick measurements on this, and I'll give you the exact weight. But it's not a 10 pounder; it's not double digit. But you know, I'm guessing six to seven pounds on the Freedom Minnow Spoon, and it took a while for me to get this fish going. Now, for those wondering where you can get this spoon at the Cane Tackle Store has them in stock, different colors. Every color works. That's the one I have in my tackle box. This is the two and a quarter Freedom Tackle Hammered Minnow Spoon in golden chartreuse. A lot of fish down there, but there you go, it was worth the wait, and there's more down there, so I'm gonna hurry up, take some measurements here. So, with the tail closed, of 26, he goes back. See <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they got me good. All right, next fish. He's gonna eat it. He's on. Fish on, my friends. Fish on. I don't know how big he is. He's always acting. Ooh, he's nice. He's a good one. He's a good one. Oop, my bad. I mean, I hit you like this. That's a good fish, man. That's a three pound walleye all day. And the middle spoon is doing work. There you go. And there's a fish down there. I'm gonna try to go get them. There's two of them. And that's a good fish right here. I mean, might be bigger than three pounds. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section down below. I'm not gonna release him yet. He's fine. I'm gonna try to fish those fish down there. I was back. Come on, bro. The water's right there. Come on, bro. You guys see that? If he comes back. If he comes back, he's eating for sure. Means he's pissed. He might be coming back. Yeah, he is. He's on my bait right now. Got him. 
<laughs> I don't know how big he is. What are we gonna find out? Ooh, he's fighting big now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's why I like these long rods. <clears throat> Where are you, bud? Oh, that's a good fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't want to get messed up. Yeah, gotta change the light when you out. Oh, that's cool. So he came back. Choke that freedom tackle spoon. You know that's that's the one I caught the big one last time I came here too, so I got confidence in it. And I got a bit heavier line and, and a beefier hook, so I can really set the hook on the big one. I'm really targeting the big ones. Like those are fun. Don't get me wrong. I'm definitely targeting bigger ones than this. This is a four pounder, super healthy. Oh, he wants to go right away. And he's gonna go. He he's coming back for more. He won't bite though, that is the problem. Good fish. Good fish. Good fish, guys. Good fish. He reacted to the smack to me snapping it. You know it's a good fish one. When they react to that, he's coming up. That's a good fish, guys. That's what we're after. Oh yeah, it's a good fish. I just saw him. Oh boy. 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 That's a good fish, ladies and gentlemen. That's a good fish. Oh my god. Might be my PB. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at this thing. No. No. No, but. Oh, God, it's a nice fish. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> I'm happy now. Uh, I'm going to put this here so you guys can see me. Oh, it's a good fish, guys. It's not my PB, but I you know, I got this fish going. It took a while. Uh, man, that's a good 7, 8 pounder. We're gonna measure them for you guys on the freedom minnow spoon i mean just a toad and i slept here all night and you know what i wanted to be gone as soon as the rain stopped and man you gotta grind embrace the grind man embrace the grind in fishing and working out in life because hardships are what makes Things like this feel good. Look at this, how he choked it. Beauty, 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 beauty. I'm happy. So, I'm gonna take him out. He was pinned good with the top hook. Side hook came out. Quick measurement. Quick measurement. Uh, you know, that's a seven pound wall, I would say. Um, I don't weigh them, that's how you, walleyes have really fragile jaw, unless you weigh them in a bag. All right, that's a 28 inch walleye. I put it there, there you go. About there, 28 inch, just under 28. So 27 and three quarters and uh, 15 inch and a quarter of dirt. Yes, yes. So that's it. We're gonna go ahead and release this puppy and put him back down there so we can make more kids. That's a good fish, man. That's a really good fish. Well worth, this is gonna be a good video. Man, that's a beauty fish. 
Little biggie. Little biggie. Oh, that's good. <laughs> yes. Yes, guys. Yes. That's it, man. Uh, I'm going to try to get one more, and then we're going to get going. I really worked on that, guys. You guys saw it. That's it for me. That's a wrap. I'm going to go home. I'm going to recharge. Hope you enjoyed this video. Of course, please like, subscribe, and share the video. Sharing the video is the best you can do, man. It's, it's helping me out big time. I appreciate all the support. All the stuff I use today, my rods, my line, my reels, the Freedom Tackle Spoons, uh, Minnow Spoon, the hammer, uh, Hammered Minnow Spoon is on CanadianTackleStore.com. Let's go.